All right. Take the sack off of her. <sighs> cool it, lady. Hysterics, I'm going to help you now. You know why you're here, right? Oh, I think you do, beautiful. I think you do. See, your boyfriend is an associate of mine. Mm-hmm. Sure. Because you don't got a boyfriend. Come on, a pretty little thing like you? Ain't got no taste for bad men that are a little dangerous? Sure. <laughs> Did you just try to scold me with a young man? <laughs> That's cute. But I'm pretty sure I'm more than 15 years your senior, little lady. Now, let's get down to business, huh? Virk, leave us. Yeah, I'm aware. Smoking cigars ain't great for my health. What's next? You gonna tell me to put on a sweater? Yeah, yeah, I'll catch my death of a cold. Look, lady, cut the shit, all right? We're looking for Danny. No, we ain't seen him in weeks. That's the problem. He owes me a lot of money. Mm-hmm, yeah, I bet. I bet he's not called you in weeks either. I'm sure you're incredibly worried about your boyfriend and all. That's why we need you to cooperate with us. Okay, sweetheart? So I'm a reasonable man. Wait. Sorry. Hold, hold up. You ain't Danny's girlfriend? You're his mother. I, uh, <clears throat> wow, I mean, wow, really? You're not kidding. Well, uh, man, I say, you look damn good for it, man. Well, of course, I meant all my compliments. Baffled me like crazy that that kid had managed to snag a beauty like you. And it turns out you're the little nuisance's mother. <laughs> I'll be damned. <sighs> I apologize for my current demeanor, ma'am. Truly. When you're the boss, sometimes you gotta be a little harsh, you know? But to answer your question, yeah. Danny's been working for me up until recently. Then the little shit, no offense, decided he'd run off with $20,000 that belongs to me. Look, I don't want to come down hard on the kid, but if I do nothing, thank you for understanding. Danny got a lot of potential, and despite how this must look, you did a good job of raising him solo. He speaks highly of you. Always afraid you find out his line of work and disown him or something. <laughs> That's what I said. Um, can I offer you something? Wine? Bourbon? Sure. A bit of wine for the young lady. There we go. I really am sorry for scaring you, miss. Usually when I have to do this, I get spitfires that get in my face, won't get with their boys for nothing, and force me to be a big, bag, scary thug versus a reasonable man. Oh, please, please. Mr. Smiles was my father. Call me Jameson. Or just James, huh? Sorry, I just... Man, I can't not get over how young you look. Pretty thing like you must have dudes falling all over themselves just to ask you out, huh? What? If they're bothered by you being a single mom, then they just don't know what they're missing. Me? A father? <laughs> no, I've never had a chance to settle down in my line of work. I do spoil my nieces rotten, though. Especially when my brother-in-law gets under my skin. One wrong look, and I'm taking him to see Glenda the Good Witch on ice and buying him the loudest, most annoying toys I could find. <laughs> oh, I know. I'm a bad, bad man. Listen. I don't like putting young men in graves. Danny's a little shit, but he doesn't deserve to get a bullet between his eyes. I don't think. 
Not when he's got such a beautiful, caring mother waiting on him to come home. Am I flirting? Well, I might be. It's not often I find a lady my age that's just so... I mean, part of my French, but damn. Can't exactly help myself, can I? Especially after I made such an ass of myself. I've been told I can be quite the charmer when I want to be, yeah. You're quite the charming yourself, my dear. <laughs> Would I forgive Danny if you agree to a date? Hmm. You are a beautiful woman, my dear. No question. $20,000 is a lot. However, I admire your drive to protect your son even more. Oh? You think that I might get him to come home so we can talk about this? Hmm. He's protective of you, huh? Doesn't seem it. Not to mention that you could be snatched by a devastatingly handsome mobster to pay for his crimes. No offense, I mean... He could stand to be a little more considerate, is all I'm saying. <laughs> really? He's interrupted every single date that you've been on over the past few years? That against a new dad, huh? <sighs> I can honestly never say I thought I would be in a position where I could take one of my associate's mothers out to dinner just to potentially get a mild amount of revenge and make a point. That's a high school joke, you know? Hey. I want Danny safe too, miss. I promise. I don't kill unless I absolutely have to. And I understand how young men get mixed into this sort of lifestyle. Money's good, lots of freedom, but the power can really go to your head, I suppose. <laughs> no drugs, ma'am. Not my style. Though I can't speak for his activities outside of work, though. So, uh, what time am I picking you up this Friday? 8 p.m. it is. Dress up for me, won't you? Been a while since I've had someone so beautiful on my arm. Oh, yeah. I'll text Danny and let him know we met. If that doesn't drag him home, then maybe seeing us at a nice dinner will do the trick. <laughs> oh, I promise I am a perfect gentleman, miss. Here, let me kiss the back of your hand to prove. See? <laughs> so bashful. Been a while, huh? Me too. Hope you'll forgive an old dog for any mistakes that he might make over a nice dinner. Perhaps a show? Oh, it's no trouble. I really appreciate you cooperating with me on this, ma'am. You're truly a delight. Don't worry, sweetheart. I have the address and everything, and you have my word that Danny won't be harmed, okay? You just relax, and I'll see you come Friday, alrighty? Great. Furcon, take this nice lady home, please. If she's hungry, you pull over and get her what she wants, got it? If she needs to pick up clothes for the date, you pull over, go on with her, tell her what looks good. Got it? I'm Mike Tap. It's no trouble, miss. Honest. Consider it my apology for such a violent introduction, okay? Besides, money's no object when it comes to a beautiful lady. Have a good night, ma'am. I'll see you on Friday, alright? Okay, 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 okay. Hello, ma. Hey, uh, yeah, I know it's late, uh, but, uh, I kind of got a date on Friday, and I may need the good suit I left with you to get ironed. Yes, she's worth the suit, okay? Can I come pick it up or not? Thank you. I'll be over tomorrow. Yeah, she's a single mom. Oh, uh, I've met a kid. Yeah, I've met him. We get along most of the time. Anywho, uh, I'll be by tomorrow to pick up the suit. I love you. <sighs> yes, Ma. I'll bring groceries for dinner. I love you. Good night. Well there, Danny. Looks like you done messed up. <laughs> 